I remember uh, really my childhood at the AUB at the Van Dyke, if I recall well, where there used to be a fountain. Yes. You see that Birki <laughs> stayed in my life because right now in all my showrooms, my stores, I have the Birki. It really reflects the same kind of shape of the, this fountain that was at Van Dyke now is reflected in my showroom. I dream about it all the time. It is part of my culture and my brand. In 1982 was my graduation year, and at the very end of it, around June, I can't remember the exact date, perhaps it was June 6, um, the AUB Modeling Club had asked me if I would uh, do a fashion show for them. From my, the wardrobe that I you know, would come to school, I would come to college actually with hats and umbrellas and petticoats. So everybody was looking at me like I'm so different than anyone else. So eventually I was asked if I could show my wardrobe uh, as a fashion show. I'm like, okay, why not? I'll do that. And uh, within 10 days, I had to prepare all my wardrobe to show it on stage. And that day, it was uh, on the Green Oval. And I remember that all the students, actually, we have pictures still, all the students from AUB were gathering around uh, the Green Oval, um, and they were watching this fashion show. And I was fascinated. Like, oh my God, all these people are looking at the wardrobe that I wear every day to college or I go to parties to. And um, then they called me on stage. At that time, I remember the moment, the exact moment when I went on stage. I had a microphone uh, on with me and I had said thank you to everybody for giving me this opportunity to show my wardrobe. And that was the moment when I decided that my career was going to be what it is today. I had dreamt it in one split second and I went for it. Just two weeks later, I went to the United States. So that was a moment that was a breaking moment for me in my life and in my career. Absolutely. Uh, I was involved with uh, the folklore dance, for example, so it got me out of my shell and made me um, be more active. Uh, I loved dancing, so I, I was part of it. And I also, I remember now that I designed uh, a whole wardrobe for um, the folklore group at, at AUB. I still have pictures of those. And it was a serious commitment. It wasn't like I'm just going to put two, two things together. It was a commitment. I needed to make the wardrobe for uh, certain people, take measurements. I've never done this in my life, but really it was a committed, a committed complete um, project that I took from A to Z. So these things kind of help to, uh, to mature a person and to make sure that you, you are responsible for things. and. Uh, always having fun at the same time. Today, when I'm designing my collection, I did remember one element I designed for the folklore group, and I'm integrating it in the next collection. AUB, happy 150th.